Hey, what's up? Uh, this video is about how to turn this into this. Uh, not literally, of course, but uh, let me let me just tell you a brief story. Uh, I, I went camping last weekend, came home, went downstairs to my laundry room in my apartment building, and I found this chair down there. Uh, it had a note on it that said free. So I threw my laundry in the machine, grabbed the chair, brought it back upstairs, and uh, kind of sat in it and thought, oh, you know, it's a nice chair. I've always kind of wanted a leather chair, but uh, it wasn't really super comfortable. And I flipped it over. It had a label on the bottom. It's an Ikea product. I've owned a few things from Ikea over the years, and uh, they, they're nice, good value. Uh, but I just find that ergonomically, they're not the most comfortable pieces of furniture in the world. So I took a photo of it. I put an ad up on Craigslist. And I looked up the price of the item and, the, and, and like the name of it, and it's some bizarre thing in Swedish that I can't remember. But uh, originally, this chair cost two hundred twenty-nine dollars. They still have it on the website, so I decided to ask one twenty-five. Um, a lady has contacted me, and she's apparently coming over in the next hour or two to have a look at it. So uh, what I'm going to do is, uh, you know, obviously sell the chair, hopefully for the full price. Uh, but I, I'm willing to take less for it, definitely. And uh, afterwards, I'll have money to go out and buy a new knife. Uh, this is the Sog Flash 2. But uh, the, the knives that I'm thinking about buying are the uh, Cold Steel uh, Recon 1, the AK-47, or the American Lawman, one of those three. Um, I've also thought about the Kershaw Blur for a long time. And what was the other one that I was thinking of? Uh, maybe the Spyderco Manix 2 Blue Translucent. I think that's a pretty cool knife, too. Uh, you know, there's a, a lot of knives out there, really, that I would like to have. Maybe the Ontario Rat 7. Um, I'm, I'm not really not uh, as passionate about buying fixed blades because you can't really use them day-to-day -day kind of thing. It's more for special trips into the bush, etc. But, uh, you know, I could just take this money and do something else with it, very responsible. But I think sometimes it's nice just to treat yourself. I haven't bought a knife for a couple months now, so... The chair is a special gift. Um, you know, one man's trash is another man's treasure. So we'll see what happens, but I'll do an update video afterwards and let you know what I bought with the money. Thanks for watching.